Hello guys, welcome back to e Civil Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. In today's lecture, we are going to explain admixtures in concrete. So what is what are the admixtures and why we use admixture in concrete? So basically, concrete is a construction material that has different components like cement. Concrete is composed of cement, water, the fine aggregate. and coarse aggregate and it also contains admixtures so what is the purpose of admixtures in the concrete so in today's lecture we will be focusing on the admixtures so basically there are two types of the admixtures so one is one we call is mineral admixtures one is the mineral admixtures so for example if i let's suppose delete these things here so one is a mineral admixtures and the second one is the chemical admixtures so there are two mostly commonly used admixtures in the concrete and they have different purposes the mineral admixtures have different purposes and chemical admixtures used in the concrete has different purposes the mineral admixture used in order to increase the strength of the concrete increase the strength of concrete they are also used to making the concrete more durable so it makes the concrete durable or we can say the long lasting makes concrete durable so it increases the durability of the concrete structures and it also increases the strength of the concrete by adding the mineral admixture the third benefit of the mineral admixture is that it makes the concrete more eco-friendly eco-friendly it means that it it helps to reduce the co2 emission it helps to reduce the co2 emission when we put this type of admixture in the concrete then they also help to, to reduce the CO2 emissions not all of the mineral admixtures but some of the mineral admixtures are used to reduce the CO2 emissions so we can say that it makes the concrete more eco-friendly the fourth one is that mineral admixtures are used to reduce the heat of hydration heat of, heat of hydration what does this mean? It means when we put the concrete in any structure members, then there is a high amount of heat release during the pouring of the concrete. It is initial fresh state. So what we do, we put this mineral admixture and it reduces this reaction which is occurring between the cement and water at the early stage. So by putting the mineral admixture, it reduces the early heat of hydration. So this helps in making the concrete more strengthable. So it helps to reduce the heat of hydration. So now what are the main chemical admixture and what are their purposes? Their most common purposes are they are helpful in increasing the workability or we can say it makes the concrete more workable. So they have high workability. High workability. The second one is it has high acceleration of the setting high acceleration of setting time of concrete so when we pour the concrete in any structure member so when it setting time is higher so by acceleration of the setting time I mean when we pour the concrete in any structure member so it has the high high setting time so what we do sometimes we need early high strength so for this reason, we put such type of admixtures, chemical admixture into the concrete in order to accelerate the setting time of the concrete. So when before the setting time, for example, is 50 minutes, 50 minutes. So by putting the chemical admixtures, they accelerate the setting time of the concrete. So it makes it 20 minutes. So now we get our strength early before we got in 50 minutes and now we can get our strength in 20 minutes so it increases the acceleration time 
or acceleration of the sitting time of the concrete. There are some of the mixtures they, that are used to decelerate the sitting time and they are known as the retarding admixtures or we can say they are used to they are used for retardation of the sitting time they are used for the retardation of sitting time of concrete by retardation i mean that it decreases the sitting time of the concrete for example before if the concrete is getting hardened in 30 minutes so now it decreases the speed and now it will be hardened in 50 minutes so there are some concrete there are some admixtures that are used in the concrete that increase the setting time in the concrete so they are known as retarding chemical admixtures and their purpose is retardation of the setting time or we can say decrease of the setting time the fourth benefit we can say is the control of the density so they are also used for the density control of the set of the concrete by density control means that we can produce lightweight concrete producing lightweight concrete so these are the different advantages of the mineral and chemical admixtures so hope you guys understand and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily seven engineering videos thank you for watching our video